Hello and welcome to our new of Trains app and today we're at Crewe on the West Coast Main Line we'll be seeing some of Anti-West Coast, London North Western Railway, Transport for Wales and Northern. Uh, it may as well call it uh, Crewe Garden Centre quite frankly there's so much buglier around it's ludicrous. I mean look at it. That's, <laughs> it's, it is beyond staggering that They've let this much foliage grow around a station. I'm, I truly find that staggering. Uh, right, well anyway, down there is 390.009 with the 1325 Avanti West Coast service to London Euston. Here goes a Transport for Wells 197 in the form of 197021 with the 1321 Transport for Wells service to Chester. Nine seven zero eighteen brings up the rear. I'm not entirely sure we'll be seeing any freight passing through here, but uh, I'm going to be here for the day. So, with that all being said and done, and just. Well, that's wonderful, now shush. So with that all being said and done, and me telling Anne to shush, this is going to be a recurring theme throughout the course of the video. <laughs> we shall see what shall turn up. Okay, the next train to make an appearance is going to be a terminating transport for Wales service, but I have no idea where it's come from. I'm led to believe that this is going to be working a service to Pembroke Dock. It's worked by 175102. And you'll also be blah, 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 blah. you'll also be seeing services from EMR when I go down to the bottom end of the station. Oh, and down there you can just see the front or tail end, depending on your point of view, of DRS 57309 as the resident Thunderbird locomotive. Well, that'll be that, that'll be that then. But I have no idea where it's come from because I can't find anything on real-time trains to give me any information whatsoever. Helpful. Okay, getting ready to depart a minute late is going to be the 1326 of Anti-West Coast service from London Euston to Liverpool Lime Street. When you consider the importance of crew, it really is a run-down station. by 39123 as also coming in is the 1332 of Anti West Coast service from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston worked by 390046 I'm hopeful that during my stay here I'll be able to catch at least one of the Transport for Wales Mark IV sets, if they're running. And that's a bloody big if. Okay, well as the wind picks up now, 175102 is heading off for the 1329 Transport for Wales service to Pembroke Dock. Very, very quick turnaround. Really, really not liking this wind. Okay, the next range back of appearance is going to be a terminating northern service from Manchester Piccadilly. by 323235 
Right, the weather's starting to turn, so I'm going to have to uh, head down to the bottom end for a little bit, I think, and then come back up here for some more Transport for Wales services, seeing as there are no through trains to Shrewsbury, they're all taking the bus. So I don't think I'll be seeing any Mark IV sets turning up whilst I'm here. But I'll go down to the bottom and uh, film everything from down there for the time being. Okay, well I've made myself, <coughs> well, walked down to uh, the tail ends of Crew Station. Uh, you've got the Rail Charter Mark III's there. Uh, behind the shed you've got the former EMT Mark III's. I don't actually know what the plan is for the EMT ones because they still have the EMT colour scheme to them. So it'll, it'll be interesting to hear what the uh, plans are for them. Then we have obviously LSL's uh, little workshop here at Crew. You've got the 86, the 87, 90001 in view. 90002 is uh, behind the other three AC locos. Then you have Lady Diana Spencer, the Scott Rail Livery 47 parked up. Uh, there is a Mark II uh, BSO there. Uh, there's a Mark I over there. Then it looks like you have uh, an old parcels Mark I parked up. There are two Porterbrook uh, Mark I barrier wagons uh, parked up behind the 86. And, oh, yeah, uh, when I turned up, about there, <laughs> you had the um, Resident Green 45, courtesy of LSL. I'm not entirely sure what that was up to, because I can't actually see it around here, and it never ran to the other end of the station, so I don't quite know what its plan is. Well, there is 35246 that terminated in from Stafford. It was going to be working a service to Liverpool, but was uh, cancelled because of trespassers on the line. So it was terminated here at Stafford. Stafford, really? This is Crew. It, ca it came from Stafford. Turn up, terminated at Crew. Put your teeth back in. Think about the words you're using there. Well, I haven't done that thus far, so I break the habit of a lifetime. Yeah. Right, and down at the carriage sidings. There was an event West Coast 2 to 1 Super Voyager. There were two uh, Transport for Wales Mark IV sets. And I think we've got the new 730s for West Midlands Railway parked down there as well. There were at least two sets. Uh, 68014 and 68015 are parked up uh, on the sidings around the corners or just behind the resident AC locos. And that is about it so far. There's a bit of a wait for the next train to come through, which in theory should be a Glasgow to London bound of anti-West Coast service, but uh, we shall see. So yes, that's now everybody up to date. Let's just do like a little news thing. I'll just pop to stations and just do news stories. Because that's essentially all I've just done. You know, up, up, up to the minute news. Okay, the next train to pass through, running about 10 minutes late, is going to be an Avanti West Coast Class 390 Penzolino, running from Glasgow Central to London Euston. Slowly approaching a single aspect down by the sidings. Okay, the next train to come through about three minutes early will be another Avanti West Coast Class 390 Pentolino running from London Euston to Glasgow Central. Be worked by 39126. Going at a nice sedate speed. Okay, the next train to arrive is the very late running 1332, 
London Northwestern Railway service from Birmingham New Street to Liverpool Lime Street. This will be worked by a pair of Class 350 EMUs. Leading the way is 350 372. Three fifty four oh nine will bring up the rear. In fact, nope, this train is now terminating here. This won't continue on towards Liverpool. As now departing is the late running thirteen fifty nine London Northwestern Railway service to Stafford, worked by three fifty two four six. Doing about turn to incoming, the 1404 of anti-West Coast service from Edinburgh Waverley to London Euston. To get the number for that 390 when she leaves. Okay, about ready to depart, five minutes late is going to be the 1404 of anti-West Coast service to London Euston. There's the pop. There's the hiss. And there's the wine. So this will be worked by Okay, the next train to arrive, coming in about three minutes late, is going to be the 1410 of Anti-West Coast service from London Euston to Manchester Piccadilly. Being shoved onto Platform 5 as Platform 6 has been taken up by those terminating 350s. Not entirely sure what the plan is for those yet. So this is worked by 39127. Everything's just running late today. Okay, the next train to arrive is a late terminating London Northwestern Railway service from London Euston, which subsequently means its return to London Euston is also uh, delayed as well as it was supposed to have already left for London. So as soon as it comes in, driver's going to hop in, passengers will board and it will then head straight back out. So leaving the scene is 352.51.
350 374 brings up the rear as there goes 39127 with a very late running 1410 of anti west coast service to manchester piccadilly i would hazard a guess that those 350s will form a service to birmingham new street Interesting to see how this all plans out. Okay, the next train to come in, running about 20 minutes late, is going to be a terminating East Britain's Railway service from Newark Castle. And again, it should have already have gone back out to Newark Castle. Apparently they're putting this one down to early operational errors. I'm sure they're just plucking out excuses out of a notebook. But either way, this is worked by 17512. There you go, there's another trespass one. Okay, and heading straight back out is going to be the late running 1413 London Northwestern Railway service to London Euston. Okay, now parting is the 1423 of Anti West Coast service from Liverpool Lime Street to London Euston, courtesy of 39131. <laughs> oh, brilliant. way to find and come in the 1426 of anti west coast service uh, from london houston to liverpool lime street because the 39124 Okay, that's Martin. About 24 minutes late is the 1410 EMR service to Newark Castle, which is about 17512. Consumes his microphone. We have him coming here, the 1432 of Anti West Coast service from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston, worked by 39155. Railway Benefit Fund. Utilising the entire platform there. Okay, and the next train to arrive is going to be the 1432 London Northwestern Railway service from Birmingham New Street to Liverpool Lime Street, worked by a pair of Class 350s. So 
Info leading the way and bouncing our way in will be 35245. With 35264 bringing up the rear. Three fifties everywhere. Okay, we're departing now is the fourteen thirty two of Anti West Coast Service to London Euston, along with three fifty two six six and one of her classmates with a service bound for Birmingham New Street, but I can't seem to find it on real time trains anywhere, so I'm gonna assume it's also the fourteen thirty two service, because that is the fourteen nineteen, which is starting here. Vic Hall is this one, courtesy of 35375. If it's not running bang on time, it is just running ludicrously late. I think we're doing well here. So at some point, the 350s that came in from Birmingham might actually be able to return. Okay, we've got a couple of trains coming in here. The first one will be a terminating London North Western Railway service from Stafford, courtesy of 350-369. Then from Crew Carriage Sidings, there'll be an Avanti West Coast 221 Super Voyager that will be working the 1445 to Hollyhead. And then you've got a Northern 311 that has just made an appearance, sorry, 331, uh, that's just come in from uh, Manchester Piccadilly. So I shall then wander back over the guests here. So you get the Avanti West Coast Voyager. Okay, so this is 221108. Right, well, on platform 5, the 350s that left for Birmingham were apparently the 1419s that left at 1432, so I really don't know what they've now got timetables for this, because this was supposed to be the 1419, but they're now changing everything up, so I don't actually know what that's going to be doing. Okay, the next train to pass by will be... Penny the Penzino 39122 working a service from Glasgow Central down to London Euston. Right, I'm going to leave you with a final few shots of some of the fleet courtesy of, uh, of LSL. There's not much going on and I need to go and get some tickets sorted to head off to uh, another station. So, thank you all very much for watching, it is greatly appreciated. If you have enjoyed what you've seen today, then please do like and subscribe and feel free to leave a comment. I do get back to them as and when I get the opportunity to. Sporadic, at best, I think is the best way to describe my uh, comment answering. But uh, I've enjoyed filming here. I'd like a little bit more, a little bit more variety, but uh, it's all going rather against me for the time being. But enjoyable nevertheless. Uh, I'm thinking that my next station is going to be uh, Preston. So I'm going to get my ticket sorted and then uh, wait for a train to take me up there. So until next time, from me here at Crew on the West Coast Mainline, I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.